So Bill Paxton is here today. So obviously the easiest question to ask is this this generation's twister. He hasn't aged a day, has he? Crazy. Isn't it crazy? That's what being in a twister movie does for you, yeah. eh, Max? Yeah. Hey, yeah. That's what you have to look forward to now. Be good for you, lad. Yeah. I mean, how long ago was it? 20, 20 years? No, it was... No, yeah, 96, 95, 96. 96, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I think it's interesting that there hasn't been another movie that's quite like this one in, in all of that time. And, uh, but in the meantime, there's been a hell of a lot of weather, you know, and, and uh, it couldn't be more topical, really, when you see the freak weather that's happening across the globe. I mean, that's not what our movie is. It's a piece of, you know, great entertainment. It's a thriller. The monster in the movie is a very unpredictable weather state, which I think is, uh, is really exciting. But yeah, it's, it's interesting that there hasn't been a movie like that for 20 years. Is it, does the sort of found footage feel of it lend itself to a disaster film? Because we don't always see that. I, I think so. It was kind of a surprise that that hasn't been done, uh, hasn't been done more. Yeah, it's, uh, I just think the the found footage thing makes it more visceral to be to be thrust right into the middle of the storm, um, is kind of is kind of affecting and makes it all seem uh, more dangerous. Yeah, yeah and it also it, it adds that um, that sense of really getting inside of it, which is the purpose of the movie. You know, that the main drive of the film are storm chasers who want to capture. They're compelled to capture the, the, these images that have never been seen before, and I think you know the multi-camera aspect of the found footage gives you that immediacy that, that you know, with with you guys, you're on iPhones or something, aren't you? That, We're iPhones or, and, and just uh, you know school video equipment. Yeah, we have three different perspectives that all kind of uh, entwine, so you kind of get you kind of get the the sense of the way the storm affects this community, this small town. Yeah, it gives it a kind of fragility and an edginess, which I think is really interesting. Yeah. Do you think that a tornado is the scariest of all of Mother Nature's disasters? It's kind of a type. I think after seeing this movie, I would probably say yes. Yeah. I've, never, I've never experienced a tornado, but from people that have uh, experienced it and have sat through the, uh, some of the test screenings of the film, I think it, it's, uh, it is probably the most terrifying thing you could experience.